This video is sponsored by Buy Me A Coffee. So around the start of 2021, I was in need of a simple shop website to host my Lightroom presets I was coming out with at the time. I actually saw an Instagram ad for Buy Me A Coffee and I liked the look and functionality of the site, so I set up a page for myself. Long story short, I now use Buy Me A Coffee to host my Lightroom, voiceover audio, and music mixing presets, in addition to using it as a Patreon type page where people can donate small or large amounts of money. The company actually recently reached out to me to sponsor this video, and considering I used the site for years before any communication, I agreed. So this video is actually going to be me walking you through the release of a digital product on the site, which will in turn demonstrate all the things I like about this platform. First off, covering our example digital product, I'm going to put up an early version of my 2023 Jason R Lightroom presets. Lightroom is photo editing software and preset packs are a collection of files you import to bring in settings. These settings give different looks and I've given each of the looks in my pack a funky name like all too familiar product shot and peering out. Now let's dive into buymeacoffee.com to set up the product page. On the left hand side of the creator dashboard you'll see a monetization tab. Ultimately that's the core of what this site offers, streamlined and mutually beneficial ways to monetize internet content. Uh, we're headed to extras for this video but there are other ways to monetize like memberships where people pay regularly for recurring perks and wishlist where you let people crowdfund gear or products you got your eye on. It's important to know Buy Me A Coffee deducts 5% from each transaction with no extra fees on top of that. I'm actually totally fine with that rate though. From within extras, I'm going to click my extras, then digital download to start the process of releasing my presets. 2023 Jason R Lightroom preset pack should do the trick for a title and I have a general format to follow for the description from my 2020 Lightroom preset pack. And for the image, I've got a clean before and after showing off one of the looks. And that's really it besides a custom confirmation message that actually includes the Google Drive download link and some checkboxes. Now let's jump out of the creator dashboard into what the audience sees. My specific page is buymeacoff.ee slash jasonr or just buymeacoffee.com slash jasonr. And we'll take a look at the new product page in a sec, but first let's cover the homepage. You can see I got about 50 supporters and these are actually only people that paid for something. There's actually approaching a thousand people that claimed one of my free products. Uh, and then there's a nifty box here to simply donate money, a post section, and a preview of some free and paid extras. And from the extras tab, you can see all of them. There's the brand new 2023 Jason R Lightroom presets, which has a clean and self-explanatory product page. I also got some stuff under the shop tab, which appears to be getting phased out, but so be it, extras offer the same functionality, but with pictures. So we've covered a good amount of ground with what Buy Me A Coffee is and how to release a digital product through the site. Keep in mind there's other monetization methods like what we saw under the monetized tab like memberships, wishlist, and commissions. I personally have stuck to digital products, which is why I made the video on that, something I know, but I'm definitely looking at moving into other methods in the future. So yeah, that about wraps it up for the video. If you're a creator looking to monetize your content in a simple yet elegant way with a lot of options, check out Buy Me A Coffee. And of course, take a look at my page at buymeacoff.ee slash jasonr to experience the site for yourself and potentially check out my stuff. See you later.